Hello, good evening again. I'm so Hello, sorry. Teacher. Hello, Isidro. I'm so sorry. Uh, I have okay, yes, I am back. Uh, okay, I have sure. some problem with my computer. I don't know what is happening. It is not working appropriately, but let's try it again, right? So welcome again to the class. Thank you very much for being here tonight with me. And we're going to start with today's topic. Today we're going to study the simple pass of the verb be. So I'm going to share with you my screen. Let me know, please, if you can see it. Here is the okay. presentation for tonight. Simple pass with the verb to be. So what is the meaning of the verb be? Teacher, oh. Um... Se fue otra vez. Se fue. <laughs> I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> okay. Now we can see the screen. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. So let's hide this and let's start with tonight's presentation. Yes, a second. Yes, okay. So do you remember the meaning of the verb be in Spanish? You say yes, right? In, in simple present, it has three forms. ¿Cuáles son las tres formas del verbo to be en el presente simple? It has three. Sería I, you, he, she. I, R, E. Ah, ok, excelente. Es I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, and we are, and they are, right? That is in present. Yeah, the simple past of the verb be uh, in the simple I past, it, it has two forms. I was very good. Was is one of them. And, and you were. were. And you I were. Was, you were. Was, and was, was and where. Was and where. Yes, was and where. So I'm going to use was with I, and you say I was. I was. She was, she was, he it was, was, it was, and it was. And it was. And with the rest of uh, pronouns, we're going to use were. So you say you were. You were. You were. They were. Uh, we, they were. We were and also. They were. We were and also they were. They were. Positive. Okay, let's see. Let me show you this. Just a second. Here we go. So you can see here was and where. In affirmative sentences, I have these examples. I was happy. I was hungry. She was a nurse. It was a big dog. So in the first one, I was happy. What is the meaning of that sentence? I was happy. Estuve feliz. No, okay. Yo estaba feliz. Yo estaba feliz. Yo estaba feliz. Yo estuve feliz. He was hungry. He was hungry. Él tenía hambre. Él estaba hambriento. She was a nurse. She was a nurse. Ella era fue enfermera. Ella fue o ella era una enfermera. And it was a big dog. Fue un perro grande. Un perro dog. Que me mordió. Ok. Este era un perro, perro grande. grande. Uh, we were early. We were early. Nosotros estuvimos. Nosotros estuvimos. Temprano. Temprano. Ok. Uh, you were at the school. Estuviste en la escuela. Tú estuviste en la escuela. Very good. And they were quiet. Estuvieron Estuvieron callados, igual que nosotros, cuando nos preguntan. (laughs) (laughs) They were quiet. Ellos estuvieron tranquilos, estuvieron callados. Entonces, de esta manera hacemos oraciones afirmativas. The subject. ¿Cómo se pronuncia callado? Quiet. 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 
quiet. Quiet. They, they were quiet. They were quiet. So look at this. We are going to need a subject, the verb be in simple past, and the complement. It's kind of easy, the structure that we are going to follow in order to make affirmative sentences. Subject, was or where, and complement. Now let's go with the negative sentences. We are going to use was and not. Eh, contractado, eso se pronuncia wasn't. Wasn't. Then we have were and not. Weren't. And weren't. In a forma contractada, we say wasn't, weren't. weren't. I wasn't sad. I wasn't sad. He wasn't hungry. She wasn't a nurse. It wasn't a big dog. We weren't early. You weren't at the school. They weren't quiet. So any volunteer to read the affirmative sentences? Any volunteer tonight? It's your Ladies turn. first. Okay, let's choose a lady then. Let me see. Alba Marisol, can you help me please? Reading the affirmative sentences in simple past using the verb be. Okay, serían eh, las negativas, Peta. Yes, please. No, las afirmativas, sorry. The affirmative sentences. The first one. Okay. I was happy. He was hungry, she was a nurse, a nurse, it was a bit dumb, well, where early, you were at the school, they were, were quiet. quiet. Okay, thank you very much. So in this word, hungry, say hungry. He was hungry. hungry. He hungry. was hungry. hungry. Yes, hungry. hungry. He was hungry. Thank you very much. Uh, let's go to the next one. Any volunteer to read the negative sentences, please? Thank you, Alba. You did a great job reading these sentences. Thanks a lot. Any volunteer to read this, the negative sentences, please? Thank you. Right. Thank you, Alba. You can start. Thanks a lot. I wasn't sad. He wasn't hungry. She wasn't a nurse. Hello. It wasn't. Oh. It wasn't ah. a big dog. Okay, thank you. A big dog. We weren't early. You weren't at the school. And they weren't quiet. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, Alpha had some problems with the internet connection, probably. Viral. Es el karma por reírse del teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's continue then. Don't forget about this, right? For affirmative sentences, we need a subject, verb be in simple past, was or where, and the complement. For negative sentences, we need wasn't, sorry, a subject, wasn't or weren't, and the complement. And that is the structure we are going to follow. Now, let's see, to create equation with to be, you put the verb before the subject. So we are going to write the form of the verb be in simple past at the beginning of the sentence. So look at the first example, it's an affirmative sentence and you say, you were happy. So I'm saying that tu estabas feliz, right? You were happy. Now, uh, now let's see. Um, yo la vi ayer, ¿verdad? yo los vi ayer y los vi así un poco molestos. Y entonces les pregunto yo, were you happy? Were you happy yesterday? So I want to know, right? Si usted estaba feliz ayer. O oh, were you angry yesterday? Were you angry? Oh, were you sad? Were you upset? 
después del partido de la selección, were you angry or were you sad? Well, were you ah. right? Estaba usted feliz. I Estaba was sad. En... Ok, then you say, I was sad. I was angry. So, remember the structure, right? The verb be at the beginning of the sentence, the subject, the complement, and the question mark. To make a question in simple past tense using the verb be. I have here another example for you. Look at this. I Teacher, have here. Excuse me. Yes? Excuse me for the store. Uh, one question. Tell me, what is you your know, question? The difference between the, the difference between uh, hambriento y molesto. Oh, uh, pronounce? hambriento, you say hungry. En enojado, you say angry. Angry. Right. Hungry uh, and angry. Uh, angry. Yes. Hungry and angry. Mm, similar. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, You're welcome. How do you write angry? Angry. A N G R Y. Without H. Okay. Without H. Okay. So listen. A N G R N Y. Angry. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, my pleasure. Uh, let's go with this. A uh, question in, um, sorry, affirmative sentence and question, right? For you to see uh, some examples of this. Uh, I was late. I was late. So it's an affirmative sentence, right? Yo llegué tarde. I was late. Uh, was I late? The question is, was I late? Llegué yo tarde. Was I late? The second one, you were sick. You were sick. Estuve enfermo. Eh, tú estuviste enfermo. Es una afirmación. You were sick. Ah, you, now, you, you, you. Now the question is, were you sick? Were you sick last month, for example? Were you sick last month, Isidro? Yes. No, and then you say, yes, I was. Yes, yes I was. Yes, I was. Very good. Yes, I was. Now, he was surprised. He was surprised. It's an affirmative <coughs> sentence. Now, look at the question. Was he surprised? Was he surprised? Estaba el sorprendido? Then, the possible answer, right? Yes, he was or no, he wasn't. She was from Italy. She was from Italy. It's an affirmative sentence. Now the question is, was she from Italy? Was she from Italy? And you say, yes, she was. No, she wasn't. Let's go with number five. It was a big house. It was a big house. Then the question is, was it a big house? We were ready. We were ready. Were we ready? Were we ready? You were early. Were you early? They were busy. They were busy. Were they busy? Now let's see the possible answer. But before to go to the possible answer to this question, I need two volunteers. Want to read the affirmative sentences and want to read the questions. Any volunteer tonight? It's time for you to practice. Please practice, partner. Me. Don't worry. Oh, okay, okay, teacher. Can I can I start? Okay. Me, oh, who say me? Who say me? Alexis. Uh, were you, Alexis? You. Okay. Thank no. you, Alexis. Okay. And let's go. Let's go away. You can do it. Yeah. And Jonathan, okay, Alexis and Jonathan. Go, go. So Jonathan, can you please read the affirmative sentences and Alexis the question, please? Okay. You can start. Okay, teacher. I yeah. will I was late. Was I late? You were sick. Were you sick? He was surprised. Was he surprised? She was from Italy. 
Was she from Italy? It was a big house. Was it a big house? We were you ready? Where were where we were ready? You were early? Were you early? They were busing. Busy. Were they bus? Okay, thank you. You did an excellent job. Thank you very much. I really appreciate your your job at this time. So thank you. Very good practice. Thanks a lot. Yeah, just this couple of words. Early. 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 Busy. 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 Er, early and busy. Italy. Italy. Early. Oh, it's Italy. 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 Yes, uh, remember that T, when, cuando la T está en medio de dos vocales, como en este caso, se pronuncia como una R, R, R como una R suave, ¿verdad? como una R Italy. suave. Italy. 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 Yes. From Italy? Suavecito. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, es como una R, pero no como la que pronunciamos de rosa, sino que una más, when, más teacher, suave. Yes. When is when is near to a uh, a vowel? Between. When ah, between t, a vowel when, and a consonant. Italy. No, no, no. When T is between two vowels. Between two vowels. Mm. So in this case, is I okay, and okay, A. Okay, okay, okay. I between and A. Two vowel. Between two vowel sounds. Like so Italy. Italy. Italy, yes. Okay. No solo en ese caso, sino en, en otros también. Aplica. Así es, aplica en okay. otros también. Thank you. Thank you very much. Let's continue. Let's see the possible answer for those questions. Now let's see, I have here, was I late? Then you say, yes, you were. No, you weren't. So, for example, tonight, if I ask this question to you, was I late? Llegué tarde a la clase? Was I late to the class? Then you say, yes, you were, or no, you weren't. No, usted no. Sí, usted llegó tarde. Yes, you were. No, you weren't. Were you sick? Were you sick? Yes, I was. No, yes, I, I was or no, I wasn't. Was he surprised? Then you say, yes, he was. No, he wasn't. Was she from Italy? Yes, she was. Or no, she wasn't. Was it a big house? Yes, it was. No, it wasn't. Were we ready? Yes, we were. No, we weren't. Were you early? Yes, we were. No, we weren't. And were they busy? Yes, they were. No, they weren't. Okay, let's see. I have heard the next. It's a conversation break. We are going to see this question here. And also the use of the simple pass of the verb B. So let's listen this small conversation. <clears throat> Let me know, please, if you can listen. Oh, yes, teacher. Born, Melissa. I was born in Korea. Can you listen the conversation? Yes, sir. Yes, teacher. I can hear it. Okay, here we go. Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S.? No, I came here in 1999. Hmm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good, so I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Okay, now let's see. Let's analyze the first question. Where were you born, Melissa? Where were you born? So this question means, ¿Dónde naciste? ¿Dónde naciste, oh. Melissa? Where were you born? And what is the answer? I was born in Korea. 
Thank you. I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the U.S. Así que tú no naciste en los Estados Unidos. What is the answer? So you, you say? Excellent. Mm, you were pretty young. And, as, as, eras muy joven. And she said? Yes, I was only 17. Yes, I was only 17. And now the question is simple past. Did you go to college right away? The expression right away significa inmediatamente. Did you go to college right away? Fuiste a la universidad no. inmediatamente. And she said? No, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. Excellent. So no, my English wasn't very good. So I took English classes for two years first. And, and Chuck said, well, your English is really good now. So she improved in the language, right? She is very good speaking English now. So, well, your English is really good now. Thanks. And Melissa say, thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Tu English is muy bueno también. Uh, it is a Chuck. Yeah, but I was born here. Sí, pero yo nací a... Ah? Aquí. Pecado fuera. Okay. <laughs> okay, so look at this example. I was born in Korea. Simple pass with the verb to be, right? Yo nací en Corea. ¿Cómo diríamos nosotros? I was born in El Salvador. I was born in El Salvador, right? So you weren't born in the US. In the US. No, I came here in 1999. So where were you born here in El Salvador? In which city? Where were you born? ¿Dónde nacieron ustedes? ¿En el lugar donde viven ahora o se han mudado? Where were you born? And you say, I, I was born in Hampton, Pachimalco. OK. I, I was, was born in Apopa. I was born in Apopa. City. Sonsonate City. I was born in Sonsonate City. Wow. And then did you move? Did you move to another place? Se mudaron a otro lugar or do you still live there? Yes. I from in Jet lived in Apopa. Ah, okay. So you say I where were you born? That is the question. Where were you born? Donde naciste? So you say I was born in El Salvador. I was born in, in the place, right? The city. What are you born? Now, let's see, I came here in 1999. So I need to volunteer to practice in this small conversation. Uh, do you have any question about the vocabulary in this conversation? Any new word here? No new. Vocabulary, then I need to volunteer to practice in this. Who wants to participate? Practice in this small conversation. Do you want to listen again? So pay attention to the pronunciation and intonation. And then we are going to have the volunteer to practice it. Listen again, please. Where were you born, Melissa? I was born in Korea. Oh, so you weren't born in the US? No. I came here in 1999. Hmm, you were pretty young. Yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't very good, so I took English classes for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks, your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Okay, any volunteer? It's your turn to practice. Any volunteer tonight? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Walter. Walter N. Let's listen. And me. I would like to try, but uh, July, try it. 
Hello. Okay, <laughs> Walter and Julio, please. Okay, Walter, let's go. Walter, okay. you are Chuck, and Julio, you are Melissa this time. Oh, my friend. Okay. Oh, go, go, go. <laughs> go. Go, Walter. Walter, you can Ready, start. You like. Okay. Where were you born, Julio? I was born in Perula. Oh, so you were born in the El Salvador? Uh, no, I come here in 1999. Oh, you were pretty young. Uh, yes, I was only 17. Did you go to college right away? No, my English wasn't wasn't very good. I saw took English class for two years first. Well, your English is really good now. Thanks. Your English is pretty good too. Yeah, but I was born here. Bárbaros. Excellent job. Thank bien, you. Bien, bien. That was an outstanding work. Very, very good work. Thank you. Thank you very much. Y eso que manejando. Okay. Thank you, Walter. Thank you. Julio, thank you. Okay, let's go with the next thing. Uh, Here we go, look at this. Um, I was born in Korea, right? I wasn't born in the US. So affirmative sentences and a negative sentence. I was born in Korea. I wasn't born in the US. You were pretty young. Tu eras muy joven. You weren't very old. Tu no eras muy? Muy vieja, tú no eres muy vieja. So she was 17. She was 17. She wasn't in college. We were born in the same year. We weren't born in the same country. They were in Korea in 1998. They weren't in the US in 1998. In, la, en este año todavía no estaban en los Estados Unidos, right? They were in Korea. 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 Okay, now listen this. Ah, and here is the explanation about the contraction. Wasn't equal to was not. And weren't equal to were not. So let's listen this. Statements with the past of B. I I was born in Korea. I wasn't born in the U.S. You were pretty young. You weren't very old. She was 17. She wasn't in college. We were born in the same year. We weren't born in the same country. They were in Korea in 1998. They weren't in the U.S. in 1998. So, any volunteer to read the affirmative statements and another volunteer to read the negative statements? Who I wants want, to try? Teacher, I want to, I'm going to read the negative statements. Okay, you can start. Go ahead, Isidro, do it, please. With the negative statement? Yes, I please. Wasn't born, okay, I wasn't born in U.S. Uh, you weren't very old she wasn't in college we weren't born in the same country they weren't in the u.s in 1998 in 19 1998 <laughs> okay uh, and they perdón they weren't in the u.s in 1998 19 okay 98. 19 98 okay if you say 1998 is 90 98 19, 19. Thank you. What happened? What happened? What happened? 
Nah, he did an excellent job. Thanks a lot, Let Isidro. Me Thank more, you very much. Isidro. <laughs> <laughs> Any other volunteer to read the affirmative statement? Oh, no, teacher. Thank you, Walter. I was born in Korea. You were really young. She was 17. We were born in the same year. They were in Korea in 1998. Okay. Bravo. Excellent. Bravo. Hey, thank you, partner. That was, that was a super <laughs> job. Casi thank se you. te olvide el español, Barbara. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't remember that. How, how to say it. <laughs> you know, we can see you were practicing a lot. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you very much, Walter. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome, teacher. Um, any other volunteer to read these sentences? Who wants to try? Ladies, please. Me, any? teacher. Thank you, Good. Alpha. Come on, partners. We need practice. <laughs> we need to practice. Or yeah, negative. Yeah. negative. Thank you very much. Negative you statement. can start. I wasn't born in the USA. You weren't very old. She wasn't in college. We weren't born in the same country. They weren't in the USA in 1998. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Very thank good. you very much. That was a really nice job. Thank you. Uh, anyone Many here? Plaques. Anyone Richard, here? Se va viendo, amigos, se va viendo mucho la mejora cuando practicamos. Practicamos y practicamos. Y se nos va acomodando la lengua. Y si no, 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 no. It's correct. <laughs> <laughs> don't be shy, don't be shy. Yes, <laughs> try it, try it. You can do it. I'm sure that you can do it, yes. right? Remember that we are learning, and the more you practice, the better you get. So, yeah, so practice. Any volunteer? Okay, no volunteers. Negative statement. Okay, let's all this exercise. Let's practice. Complete the following sentences using was or were. Was or where? Was I or was. Where? was. I, I was, 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 and the I first was one, 18 last year. I was, yes, I was 18 last year. I was 18 last year. Very good. Let's see the next one. Let it be. Exercise B. Marta and Sarah born. Marta and Sarah where? 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 Painting yesterday. Where? Okay, very good. Uh, Marta and that, Sarah were painful yesterday. And the next one, let us see. Marco was, was. Marco was healthy last month. Early last the month. Back. Healthy. Letter, letter D. She was. She was sick she was last, sick last, last week. week. She was sick last week. And the next one, letter E. We, we, were, we, were, we, were, we were. We were. We were at the college. We at the college. We were at you that were. college. And the last one, you, you, was my you, were. you were my you friend. Were my friend. You, were. Or you were my friend. You were my friend, but not Not now. anymore, right? Not anymore. You were my friend. But not anymore. But not anymore. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. No nos cansamos de aprender. <laughs> okay. Any volunteer to read these sentences? Let's see A, B, C. And another volunteer to read D, E, and F. Any volunteer? Uh, Come Thank on, you. July, you need practice, July. Come on. Uh, let's listen. July, July. Come yeah. on, listen, Morena. <laughs> Alexis. Ah. Morena, can you please? Morena, A, B, and C, please. A, B, C, A, C, A, 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 A. She. Let's start. He was sick last queen. We were at the college. You were my friend. Thank you very much. Any volunteer to read A, B, and C? Thank you, Morena. And me. Thank you, Julio. Come on, you uh, That's the attitude. <laughs> I, <laughs> I, 
I was 18 last year. Martha and Sarah were painful yesterday. Marco was healthy last month. Thank you. Healthy. Marco was healthy, healthy, healthy last healthy. month. Thank you. Right. Let's go with the next exercise. Look at this. Really is good. Really good. Was or where? Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson was, 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 was a very good popular very popular. artist. Okay, yes, Michael was. Jackson was a very popular artist. The next one, the second. It was he was born in 1958. He was, was born in 1958. 1958, thank you. The, let's see the second one. Last Where? Saturday, Carlos and Irma were at home. They were, were, they were, were in the country all weekend. In the country all weekend. Okay, in the countryside, right? They were in the countryside all weekend. I was, I was worried. worried. I was because worried because they were lost. They were lost. I was they were worried lost. because they were lost. Thank you. I was worried because they were lost. Were in Valentin in. Isabel at the party. No, they were. No, they were. They were. No, they were. No, they were. No, they were. No, they were. For most people, oh, Pele, one of the best soccer players in the world. Was was one of the best soccer players okay. in the world. What? Was your favorite subject in high school? What was? What was? What was. Okay, what excellent, was. very good. It was so easy your for you. Favorite subject in high school. Okay, what was your favorite subject in high school? Uh, can you please answer this question? What was your favorite subject in high school? Walter? What's your favorite subject? My favorite English. subject is math. English. Ah, My but favorite. Compañeros, math. I like. Okay, but that is in present. Now, in past, when you were in high school, what was your favorite subject? Then the answer is it was science, it was math, it was social studies, it was English. 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 Social studies. Social studies. Only draw map. Oh, yeah. Drew maps. You did a lot of maps on yes. social studies. Um, <laughs> it's easier, <laughs> easier, it's easier. Ay. No fire. fire. <laughs> okay, <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, you are doing very good tonight. Thank you. Uh, then let's see. Any volunteer to read uh, number one, please? Who wants? Who wants to read number one? Me, teacher. Thank you, Jonathan. Can I start, Jonathan? My, Michael Jackson was a very popular artist. Continue. Yes, please. He was, he born, was born in 1958. 58. Excellent. 58. That Saturday, Saturday, Carlos and Irma were at home. They were in the county hard weekend. Oh, I was. I was worried because they were, were lots, were in Valentin and Isabel and the party. No, they weren't. For most people, Pele was one of the best soccer players in the world. What was your favorite subject in high school? It was my mate. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jonathan. Teacher, Thanks. excuse me. Yes. Uh, how do you traduce the number five? The sentence number five. 
Ah, para la mayoría de personas, para la mayoría de personas, Pelé was one of the best soccer players. Ok, thank you. Para la mayoría, for most people. Para la mayoría de personas. Yes. All right, thank you. Ok. Now let's look at the following word. Uh, how do you pronounce this? ¿Cómo se pronuncia en el number three? Eh, después no, no. I was worried. worried. ¿Cómo? Worried. Worried. Sí. Worried. 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 Cansado. No. no. Estuve preocupado porque ellos se perdieron. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Algo oh, típico. Okay. Thank you, Sidro. Okay. Fue en El Salvador, ¿verdad? <laughs> <laughs> ok. Eh, You're welcome, my friend. Hello guys, let's do uh, a look of the following words. How do you pronounce these, for example? All weekend. All weekend. All weekend. All weekend. All weekend. How do you pronounce the next one? Let's see. What's the word? Ah, you say one. What's one of the best soccer players? And the other one, how do you pronounce these words? Favorite. 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 Thank you. And Favorite. this other one? Subject. 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 Thank you. Subject. In, In high school. This one? March. Math. 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 Yes. Math. Thank you. Thank you. Math. Math. Math is my favorite subject. Okay, very good. <laughs> okay, look at this small conversation. It's a conversation between a man and a woman. So he, the man says, how was the movie? It was really good. Was it scary? Yes, it was really scary. Nice. Was it crowded? No, it wasn't. There weren't many people there, surprisingly. Any new vocabulary in this small conversation? Yes, teacher. What does... Crowded mean. Crowded. Uh, crowded mean crowded. Uh, with a lot of people. So crowded. When there is a lot of people in a place. So crowded. Oh. In Spanish. Lleno. Lleno. Oh. Lleno de personas. Crowded. Lleno. A reventar. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Any crowded. other word? Crowded. Any other new word? Crowded. Any Sur other new Surprisingly. Sorprendentemente. Surprisingly. Okay. Surprisingly. <laughs> okay. Surprisingly. 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 Okay. Surprisingly. To volunteer to practice this is my conversation. I'm going to choose. Let me see. We're going to choose. Adonis. Adonias and Nestor, can you please help me in this conversation? Adonias and Nestor, please. Yeah. And you can start, Nestor, and then Adonias. Okay. Come on, partner. you can do it. How was the movie? It was really good. What is scary? Yes, it was really scary. Nice. Was it crowded? No, it wasn't. There weren't man, many people there surprised. Surprisingly. 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 Okay, thank you. That was a nice pronunciation. Thanks a lot. Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Let's see the next one. Conversation number two. It says, where were you last night? Where were you last night? I was at work. Really? I was at your shop. You weren't there. No, I was in the bag working. Were you? Really? I was there. So look at this. Look at this question. Where were you last night? ¿Le suena conocida esa pregunta? ¿Dónde yes. estuviste esa noche? La Where were noche. you last night? Yes. So, ¿dónde El trabajo. Esa... I was at work. Really? I was at your shop. You weren't there. 
Yo estuve en tu tienda y tú no estabas ahí. And the woman said, no, I was in the back working. No, I was in the back working. Estaba en la parte de atrás, traba. And trabajando. Were you? Estabas ahí. Really, I was there. Yes. El girlfriend. En la verdad. novia le estaba reclamando. Wow. Ah, al clave. revés, al revés. El, el novio está reclamando. Oh, celoso. El man. Aquí el sí, man sí, es, es el tóxico. El sí, man es, es el cierto, tóxico. Es una, una escena de celos. Ah, ok. Yeah, probably, right? So, de verdad, le dice, yo estaba ahí. Como, okay. de, ver, de verdad está dudando. Yo estaba, yo estuve ahí. So let's see two volunteers to practice in Teacher, this small conversation. A and a woman. But, but with who? <laughs> <laughs> I may volunteer. Okay, then es, escuchemos a Isidro en ah. Morena, please. Ah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Vamos a seguir actuando. Like doing. Okay, are you ready, Morena? I was at the war. No, no, no. No, no. Are you I'm ready? Are I'm you going to ready? start first. Come. Where were you last night? I, I was at war. Really? I was at the shop. You weren't there. No, I was in the bad working. Were you? Really? I was there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Very good. Very good job. Thank you very much. Let, let's see the next. Salimos para Vegas. Para Hollywood. Okay, look at the next conversation. Um, esta conversación que tuvieron después del meeting, right? después del meeting y la oh. que van a tener después del final exam. So it says, <laughs> so it says, how was the test? How was the test? It was really hard. How long was it? There were about 20 problems. Yeah, what was your score? Let's just say it wasn't great, but it wasn't bad either. So, ¿cómo estuvo el examen? It was really hard. Estuvo muy fácil pesado. o difícil. Difícil. Pesado. Difícil, muy pesado. How long was it? Pesado. ¿Qué tan, qué, claro, tan lar, ¿Qué tan largo era? There were about 20 problems. It no, sounds okay. like it was a math. It was a math test. There were about 20 problems. Yeah. What was your score? ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál fue tu nota o cuál fue tu puntaje? So let's just say it. Solo digamos, right? It wasn't great. No estuvo grandiosa, but it wasn't bad either. Pero no estuvo mala tampoco. O no estuvo malo okay. tampoco el puntaje. So, okay. ¿cuánto, hey. creen, ¿cuánto right. creen que sacó? Lo lo pasó con 6.5 dejando los pelos en el alambre. <laughs> so, uh, I need to volunteer to practice in this small conversation. Uh, who wants to practice? Tell you me like. Name. <laughs> you like. <laughs> eh, pobre Julio, ¿verdad? Hoy sí lo han puesto a practicar. Eh, let's listen oh. Alfa and Luis. Alfa and Luis, please. And this is my conversation. Okay. Okay, Alfa. Luis, you can start. Yes. I read, ready. Do it, uh, do it. Do it, do it. Start, start you, okay. Luis. Start. Luis. It was really hard. Oh, Luis, let's start again. Luis is the man and Alpha is the woman. So, Luis, yes. can you please start? 
Okay. How long was it? No, 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 no. How, How was, was the, the test? test? How was the what, test? What happened, Luis? What happened? Yeah. What happened, Luis? What are you drinking? <laughs> um, take it easy, guys, please. Take it easy. Luis, can you please? Three. What happened with Liz? What happened with Liz? Luis? It so was weird. really hard. How long was it? There were about 20 problems. Yeah, huh. what was your score? Let's just say it wasn't great, but it wasn't bad either. Thank you, Luis. Excellent pronunciation. Thank you very much. Very, very Zero. good job. Now let's listen. Luis Dol. <laughs> <laughs> then let's listen Alexis Alexis and Alpha Alexis can you please okay, start okay. how was the test it was really hard how long was it there were about 20 problems yeah what was your score let's just say it wasn't great, but it wasn't bad either. 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 Thank either. you. Either. Thank you very much. Either. Excellent. Thank you. So, thank you. Qué bárbaro. Igual que le sale ahí pronunciando. <laughs> yes. Very good job, Santi. Um, you can practice this conversation at home. It is going to be in the presentation. Let's go with the next team. <laughs> Uh, were you at home yesterday? Was Ryan in class yesterday? Was the concert good? Was the movie interesting? Was Susan at the library yesterday? Now, these are the questions and here are the answer. Can you look for the correct answer for the question number one? Were you at home yesterday? What is the right answer? Look for the answer here from A to B. Yes, I work. Where did you at home yesterday? So you say which letter? Which letter? No. Which letter? No, I was in the concert. Thank you very much. That is the right answer, right? So you say one D, right? One D. No, I wasn't. I was at a concert. Okay. Let's go with the second. Was Ryan in class yesterday? What is the right answer? Can you find it? Yes. Oh, he wasn't. He was sick. Okay, no. He wasn't, he, he was sick. He was sick. He was sick. He was sick. Okay, so two E, two E. Let's go with the next one. Was the concert good? No, no, it was. No. Uh, oh, no, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. I was oh, a, a sorry. No, no, it wasn't. It was the music was really really bad. Really bad. Okay, thank you. So it's three A, three A. No, it wasn't. The music was pretty bad. Let's go with the next one. Was the movie interesting? Uh, yes, yes, it was. It was my name is, is a great actor. Thank you. So it's 4C. And the last one, was Susan at the library yesterday? Yes, she was. Yes, we yes, were both there. We were both okay. there. Okay, excellent. Was yeah. Susan at the library yesterday? Yes, she was. We were both there. We were both there. I need to volunteer to practice this question and answer. Who wants to practice at this time? Any volunteer to practice? It's almost the like last activity for tonight. Who wants to try? Who wants to try? Hey, teacher. Thank you, Walter. Any other volunteer? Walter N. Let's practice. Any volunteer? 
Come on, come on, people. Walter and any other volunteer? Then let's just Alexis. Someone. Alba, Alba Marisol, can you help me? Okay. Come on, Alba. Okay, so Alba, you read the question and Walter the answer. You can start, Alba, please. Were Joe I owes it yesterday? Oh no, Hello? I wasn't. I was at a concert. Were real in class yesterday? No, he wasn't. He was sick. What the concert was? No, it wasn't. The music was really bad. Was the movie interest? Yes, it was. Matt Damon is a great actor. Was Susan at the library yesterday? Yes, she was. With our brother. Okay, excellent job. Thank you. Thank you, Walter. Thank you. Okay, Thank you very much. Let's see. Uh, were you angry yesterday? What is an answer for this question? Were you angry yesterday? Yes, I did. Oh, I wasn't. Oh, sorry. Yes, yes I, I was. Yes, yes I, I was. was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. was. Yes, I was. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yes, and, now, was. and now, are you angry? Yes, I am. Hey. Right Oh, I yes, wouldn't. I, I am. <laughs> what is... Second one. Were you in a hurry this morning? Were you in a hurry this morning? Le agarró la tarde hoy y estaba apresurado. Were you in a hurry this morning? Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Very good. Oh, no, no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. The next one. Were you very, sorry, were you very busy yesterday? Yes, I was. No, I was. Yes, yes I was. Okay. Estuvo no, muy ocupado was. ayer. Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Let's see the next one. Were you a quiet child? Very. In the very past. Quiet. <laughs> Were you a quiet <laughs> child? Yes, I, I was. Believe you. You lied. Okay. No, I wasn't. <laughs> a pretty, a pretty child. Okay, and the next one, were you a good student at school? Yes, I was, teacher. Yes, okay. yes I was. Only, Only nine, yes. ten, excellent. Very good. Only, yes. Only ten, <laughs> nine, yes. excellent. Cool. Were you a good student? <laughs> okay. So do you have any question about tonight's class? Questions? No question. No question? Oh. Any question, teacher? Any question? No, any question. Me tonight. Thank you for your participation. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. So, see you on Monday, right? Enjoy your weekend. Don't forget about the platform exercises. It is important that you complete that if you can during this weekend, right? If you can, teacher. If you can do it, right? Tell me, Isidro. When, when can we repeat surprisingly? Surprisingly? Sur surprisingly. 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 Yes. Surprisingly. Cinco yes. Veces, sur surprisingly. 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 <laughs> it's like a tongue nice twister. Nice to be with you, my friend. He okay. So thank you. <clears throat> See you next class. See you. Hey, teacher. Good night, everybody. See you on Monday. Enjoy everybody. your weekend. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.